so well, there you go. There's Tavon. Just spend a few minutes with detectives Kevin Lynn and Patrick Munyon and Tavon Tanner. Uh, we're just yeah, talking bad about you. Yeah, yeah, like usual. And you can feel the love they have for each other. Family. They've essentially been a family since August 2016. That's when 10-year-old Tavon Tanner was shot. Myself and Detective Munyon were at the hospital when Tavon came through the hospital doors, and I'll never forget that. We'll never forget that. Uh, the way he looked, it, it was very grave. His mother, Melanie, was right there with him. Melanie, from right away, she, when she walked in the hospital, she was nothing but cooperative with us and understanding our job and that we are there trying to help. With her help, they were able to arrest a shooter and Tavon recovered. He's just a great kid. He's got the greatest smile. Um, doesn't say a lot at first, but then once you get him going, you know, he's, he's fun and entertaining kid. He's, you know, you know, he's fun to be around. And over the years, the bond grew so much that it was noticed by the Chicago Police Memorial Foundation. The detectives honored for their work with Tavon all the way up until now. Over the years, the detectives brought kid stuff to Tavon, baseballs, mitts, and the like. And in 2020, they started a fundraising campaign to cover tuition for Tavon at St. Patrick High School. That's right. They helped to raise money to pay his tuition for St. Patrick, and they kept him motivated. I treat Tavon like I treat my son with things. Um, the fact that we were able to have the smallest part of anything to do with that, I mean, makes me proud. They did a lot for me, and they found me. Uh, I don't really say it a lot, but I love y'all. Thank y'all too, bud.